Hi, welcome to the Miller Life Kitchen. Today I'm canning potatoes. These are red potatoes that I have peeled. And as I'm peeling, I put them in some fruit fresh so they don't get brown. Cut them up in about one inch pieces and soak them for about an hour. And then I rinse them really well and get started with my packing of the jars. I'm going to be doing quarts and I am packing these to one inch headspace. You want to try to finagle these in here so you can get as many as you can in there. I don't pack it too, too tight though. I prefer the water to stay over top of my potatoes. I'm going to put in about a quarter teaspoon of kosher salt. And then we're going to be doing hot water over top. This is raw pack. And I have my kettle heated up to about 180 degrees. Again, one inch headspace. Now I'm going to debubble. I'm going to wipe my rim. I do not have vinegar on this, it's just a dry paper towel. Put my lid on and my ring fingertip tight. Into the canner it goes. My canner is warming up on the stove. Now I'm going to proceed and get all my jars filled and then we will be back. Okay, I ended up with seven quarts of potatoes and I have them in my Presto and they are ready to put the lid on and I'm gonna be warming this up and get it steady stream of steam and we're going to vent once that begins at for 10 minutes once you're vented for the 10 minutes and you've evacuated all the air out of the canner and you're creating the steam inside i'm going to put my weight on and then i'm going to be doing a 10 pound weight and it's 10 pounds pressure for 40 minutes because i'm doing quartz Once you've processed for 40 minutes, turn off your heat source and let it cool down and depressurize to zero. And then I crack the lid. My house is pretty warm today inside. Um, it's really hot in Pennsylvania today. So I crack the lid, open them up, let it sit for about 10, 15 minutes. And I have my jars out. And now we're gonna let them sit on the counter for 12 to 24 hours and wait for them to make sure they all seal. Then I remove my rings, wash them up, label and store. Pantry stable potatoes. Thank you for coming along today. Please consider liking and subscribing. See you next time at the Miller Life Kitchen. Bye.